This is your News 4 update, powered by the Bomarito Automotive Group. Hey, good morning, everybody. I'm Maurice Drummond. Here are some stories making headlines. Breaking overnight, a police pursuit ends at Chambers and Halls Ferry in North St. Louis County. Police say they were chasing a car that had been carjacked in the city several days ago. The chase ended with two people, a man and a woman, being taken into police custody. Minutes after the first pursuit ended, police were tracking another car in Madison, Illinois. The chase went across the river and eventually ended at a quick trip near Page and Warson. Police recovered two weapons, drugs and what they believed to be counterfeit cash. Three men were taken into custody. Today, new safety measures will take effect in downtown St. Louis. Barriers are now in place on Broadway to crack down on reckless driving. Mayor Lada Cruson said you can expect some other closures as well. There will also be more police presence downtown. And today, AMC begins reopening some theaters across the country. The only one opening in the St. Louis area today will be in the streets of St. Charles. And Marcus Theaters begin opening cinemas starting tomorrow. The St. Charles Cinema will be open. Five other local theaters will open next week. Time now for a check of the forecast with Matt Chambers. And Matt, boy, I tell you, I'd love to see some nice weather today. Wednesday was a winner, wasn't it? If oh, we yeah. could just cut and paste. Why don't we? Let's, I mean, let's it's do just that. the two of us. Let's plan on doing it. Let's do Another it. Another beautiful day on tab. No doubt about it. Good morning, everyone. Yes, 81 for the top temperature yesterday. We'll add maybe two degrees to that this afternoon, maybe bump the humidity up just a little bit. But humidity will ramp up a lot more into the weekend. Long story short, when it comes to today, it's another top-notch one, the kind that you don't get in mid-August very often. Weekend rain chances are a part of the extended outlook, and I'll circle back to that after we get through with today's outlook. 66 degrees at 8 o'clock this morning. Nothing to complain about weather-wise. Lots of sunshine, low humidity, pleasant temperatures, and that lasts at least through lunchtime. You want to take lunch outside? Go for it. 78 degrees around noon. And then again, the top temperature about 83. That should happen between 3 and 4 this afternoon. And then we'll slowly slide back down the thermometer. 5 p.m. temperature at 82, mostly sunny, and fire up the grill. That's the best advice I can give you as we head into what looks like a very nice Thursday evening. But the muggy meter is out there. Beware. We're talking about the level of humidity versus your comfort. Today, it's not a problem, not an issue at all. Friday and Saturday, dew points creep up. That's a measure of moisture in the atmosphere, so it starts to get noticeably humid. And then by the second half of the weekend, and uh, yeah, we're back to the August steamy stuff. So 83 today. This is the pick day of the next seven. There is no question about it. It's a little warmer tomorrow, but this is still an OK day. Friday at 86 after a morning low at 66. Here come the 90s, though, from Sunday into the middle of next week. 90, 91, 92, 92 on Sunday, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. That's a slight chance of rain on Saturday, but it's worth noting it's mainly south and east of St. Louis. And then that rain chance spreads across the entire area on Sunday and Monday, but the probabilities remain really low. I'm thinking 20% chance of a hit or miss shower or thunder shower on Sunday and Monday. So all things considered, enjoy today. Summer makes a comeback on the tail end of that seven day.